Titans, it must mean a lot to be able to fight and have the opportunity to fight that national uh, talent here, here in Plymouth, here, here in your home state and, and for Cage Titans. So, tell me how that makes you feel. So, I mean, first of all, the Cage Titans is my favorite promotion to fight for, hands down. Um, I fought for other promotions, and this, uh, it's the way that they treat you here. It's just so much different than, uh, you know, you're, you're not just like an object to, to, to Titans as you are to other, other promotions a lot of times. I prepared in a UFC-style manner for an awesome opponent yeah. at Cage Titans, too. And, uh, you know, I honestly appreciate the, the, the opportunity to fight again in Plymouth against yeah. with, with all my case Titans family and friends. So I would have to go out to other shows to find better guys just because I would hear all the time, you know, like, oh, you have to go to this show or that show to fight th these guys. You have to fight, you have to fight, you know, good guys at this promotion or that promotion. And it's just not the case, you know. I'll you know, keep fighting case Titans because they've been so good to me. And uh, if, if that's not the case, then it's got to be UFC. There's the hope that this is just another buzz in Dana and Shelby's ear. I think during, in fights I haven't shown off my, you know, 100% potential. I think I always bring it. Uh, you know, my record basically says it all. Growing up with this, I think I really have come to love doing this. Mm -hmm. I really love, uh, you know, the preparation. I love uh, all the stuff you do in the gym to get ready, all the hard work. And then this is almost just, a, a, you know, a payoff. I've been doing more cardio sessions and then uh, more power lifting and then just little things in between too and then finally going on through my day and and doing my MMA training and then even when I get home I still have you know I still have things I do I, I watch tape and and all that stuff because I feel like it's a it's a full-time job yeah. you know? I haven't really done my research with you know some of the guys in, in the UFC but I think I, I gotta be up there with them because I'm 10 and now I have what eight, eight finishes and, and most of them are in the first mm -hmm. um, these guys with a lot less credentials that are up there, they're fighting. End of the day, that's my goal. That's my that's my dream. That's my hope. I want to make it to the UFC, and uh, I, I want to be there with with all the guys that are fighting. You know, the best in the world. Um, I got my fingers crossed that it's any day. I, you know, I'm <laughs> but you know, I, I don't count on it. I I just I just take my fights. If, if they call me, awesome. If they don't call me, then on to the next one. I'm not gonna sit around waiting for for them to give me anything that I haven't deserved and uh, you know if, if they don't think I've deserved it then I'm gonna, I'm gonna earn it. I'm going all in basically that's it I'm going all in UFC or bust so that's what that's what I'm putting in and that's what I'm getting out. Follow us on Instagram, watch us on YouTube, check us out on Facebook, visit us on Twitter and stay tuned.